We finally made it to the wildlife reserve, and this is where I'll be staying the next two weeks. Can't wait to see the animals. We have like our own milk. Milk twice a day. So, yeah. We started off with a tour of the whole place. Admittedly, it was pretty overwhelming, and I realized I had a lot to learn. Oh, wow. So, so requested cockatoos. So there's like ones that are loose too? Yeah, they're all the wild ones. Oh. So, but basically any bird, don't stick your finger because they're all white. Okay. So just be careful not to get too close. Mm. What's his name? Bolt. Bolt. Yeah. Are you a cutie? <laughs> Oh, hello! Yeah. Hi! They're so chunky. Yeah. You have sparkles and spanner and stinger and bumblebee. How do you tell the difference? Oh, you'll, you'll learn. And mini bus and There is a lot of kangaroos and wombats. Those are the primary two animals that they kept there. River, Snow White, Pilot, Choco. These are all orphans? Yeah. It's a lot of orphans. What happens to their parents? Either they get uh, hit by a car or mm. shot or... Okay, so I just got the tour of the place. Now I'm gonna change my clothes because I'm gonna get really dirty here. So they have clothes I can change into to get dirty, which is great. So let's look through here and get a whole new style, a whole new wardrobe. I'm not gonna lie, this is really comfortable. I'm not even that mad about it. Style is not gonna be a thing here, and that's okay. I'm gonna try to find some shoes that are my size too, but we'll see. Yeah, it's too big for me. I'm so comfortable. I'm really comfortable right now. I'm just gonna wear this over and over again and hope I don't smell it bad, but it doesn't really matter because it's a little stinky here because it's a lot of poop. It may seem weird to wear somebody else's clothes and shoes, but it was kind of just what I had to do, and you have to be kind of adaptable like that. Did you know that marsupials, it's like the only species that have the balls above the penis? Qua female koalas have three vaginas. What? How? And I don't know. And then the penis is like, it's it split, kind of like a snake's tongue. Yeah. The penis is like split. Wow. So she's going to show me, Azra, Azra is going to show me how to do the bottle preparation for the babies. All right. Hey, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, these are like the wombat's bottles. Okay. And these are the kangaroo bottles. So we have like three different containers. And, oh my god, we just like put them in and we put hot water in it too. I'm volunteering here for two weeks and they have a lot of kangaroos and wombats and one koala. But, and also a lot of baby kangaroos, which we're going to be feeding them right now. So, we are going to go feed the wombats now. I hear it gets pretty crazy. So, let me try and film this. I ended up not filming any of the feedings because it's a whole process of itself, and I want to save that for the next couple of videos. This is kind of just an introductory to the reserve and what I can expect being here. In the next couple of videos, I'm going to show you the routines, how to feed the animals, how to take care of them, how to clean, just a whole behind the scenes of what it takes to run a wildlife shelter and how it is as a volunteer. Where's Barry? Thank <laughs> you. 
Hello. 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 So that is going to be the end of today. Today was really cool to meet all the animals. I know it's a shorter video, but um, I'm still adjusting to everything. And yeah, we'll see what kind of adventures we have here and all the little animals we get to spend time with. Thank you so much for coming on this adventure with me. Um, wait till the next video, maybe we'll do some like um, morning routines, what life is like as a volunteer. Probably expect a lot of animal noises in the background and also not a lot of makeup on my end and kind of frumpy clothes because we're gonna get dirty and we're gonna get down with it. So I will put in the links for donations for this place and also how you can volunteer here if you want to. Um, for now, I'm gonna go to bed super early because I'm tired. I had a nap today but um, I'm just really tired, so I need to get good sleep because I have to get up at 7.30 in the morning, which you guys know is not uh, natural for me. So we're gonna try and do that. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. I love you guys very much, take extraterrestrial.